Hey guys, this is Andrew and welcome to the next episode on AF Swift Tutorials. In this video, I'd like to show you the Core Location Framework and how to work with it. So first, let's talk briefly what is Core Location. The Core Location Framework in iOS and macOS provides services for determining the user's geographic location and heading, as well as monitor regions and beacons. The CL Location class is fundamental class in this framework and that this represents geographic coordinates along with additional information such as altitude, speed, and course. In this video, we'll create a simple speedometer app using core location. So let's get back to the Xcode project. So here we have a simple Swift UI Xcode project. We will be creating that application using MVVM pattern. So first, let's import core location and create our view model. Our view model must inherit from NS object in order to work and also we must conform to observable object in order for our published objects to be visible inside of the Swift UI. And inside we need a location manager property, speed and also I would uh, I'll add another property for logs. Inside of our init, we also need to assign a delegate to location manager and request for when in use authorization. So let's add that. Right now we are getting an error that we cannot assign location view model to a location manager because it does not conform to CL location manager delegate. So let's create an extension to conform to the delegate. For delegates, we need location manager did change authorization method and also location did update locations in order to get our location data. So this is location manager did change authorization status and we are adding to a log the message in order to see what location status we are currently having. Now let's add another method did update location in order to get location data and show it on the UI. And from location we are interested especially in speed property. So let's call our speed variable from our class and assign it location dot speed which gives us a speed in meters per second. All right so now view model is ready let's switch to the view. First we need to get our view model. Alright, so we're having an error that we're missing location manager. Let's get back to the view model and inside of the init, let's assign it default CL location manager. And now compiler is no longer complaining. So let's create a simple UI for our speedometer. Alright, so now our view is ready, but we need to add one more important thing in order this to work. And that's gonna be our privacy usage description. So let's go to the project and switch to the info.p list. And in here we need to add another entry. And now we're having a user description message and we can test our application on a real device. It won't work on a simulator, you need to connect a real device in order to test it 
and also you need to better be outside because in some buildings there are poor GPS connections so we, you won't be able to test it. So this is it with the coral location. If you find this video interesting or useful give it a like. If you have any question jump to the comment section and I will see you next episode. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.